Just woke up from a little nap, woke up at 4 a.m., was at the gym by 6 o'clock, got a nasty little leg workout, and now we're back home compressing, decompressing, sorry, with some coffee here. Now, you might be wondering why this coffee looks so damn frothy. This is what I have on a daily basis here. It's 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 fresh brewed coffee in a French press, and then I throw in a scoop of whey protein in there, and I also do some collagen along with lion's mane mushroom every single day and a slab, just a thin little slab of grass-fed butter, a little bit of honey if I'm feeling it, a dash of sea salt, and it's honestly um, really, really delicious. Couple things I really need to break down in this video for you guys. Couple videos on my channel popped off regarding hair and minoxidil, and I'm sure you read this title and wondered what the hell is he talking about, right? Minoxidil has stopped working. And for all of you in the comments that said it would, you were right. You were right. I give you the credit. So I started Minoxidil and then I made a video about six months into it showing my results and it worked really well. And then I did a one year update on Minoxidil, okay? And my results were still solid. It seemed as if Minoxidil grew back a bunch of hair right on my crown which is where i was thinning and then it evened out and it stopped and then it just kind of coasted and maintained from there and that's what it's been doing but lately lately i feel like that that that's that slope's going out of you know a little decline there just a little bit and here's why i'm making this video because i'm going to find a solution to this a permanent solution that maybe does not require finasteride or minoxidil. By the way, those of you saying just take finasteride, I do not want to take finasteride because that, I don't like anything that just, you know, it blocks DHT, right? Like it's hormonal. I don't want to take something that just for, you know what I mean? I don't want to do it. I don't want to take it there. That's, so don't tell me to take it anymore, okay? Minoxidil, I don't mind because it's just topical, boom, right here, easy, you know, once, twice a day, no big deal. However, the results are uh, subpar now. Here's the kicker though. Here's where it really happened. It's October at the time of shooting this video and I love spooky season. I went to this haunted corn maze here in uh, Southern California and it was the most terrifying thing I've ever done in my life. However, I was with a, my, my, my lady and she took a photo of me from behind. So of course, after the event, we do a debriefing and I request any photo that I'm in. And I notice that even at night with pretty low light, I can see my crown. I can see my scalp, not as bad as pre minoxidil. So my hair is still at a better point than it was before. However, it, it, it seems to have just stalled right there. It, it Like I said, the slope went down a little bit and then it, now it's just kind of coasting at this like weird kind of place. There could be more hair there is what I'm saying. Now we need to get down to the root cause of this situation and 10X our efforts in order to fix this. Because if you're watching this, you've been following my journey and you're probably going through the same thing. You're probably a male aged 18 to 35 in the United States and in Europe and in India. And that's at least what YouTube tells me, I don't know. Anyways, we're gonna get down to the root cause of this. And after some extensive research, after money spent, I've come down to a protocol that I'm gonna be implementing from here on out on a regular and daily basis that is going to change this. And you are going to see another updated video on my hair with a full crown and I wanna guarantee it, I do, but can I? No, this is test, this is an experiment. So this is not a video of me saying, hey, here's my hair now, look how great it is. This is what I did. This is me saying, hey, my hair's, my, my hair's gotten better. I've gotten good results, but I want better results. Here's what I'm gonna do to get those better results. And it's a real life, it, it, it's, it's a live, uh, what, what, what do you call it? It's a, it's a live experiment. So let's think about a couple of things here. Two words I wanna to bring to your attention, blood flow. So let's break this down. Why does minoxidil work? It stimulates hair follicles and increases blood flow to the scalp, to wherever you put it, I guess. Why does it stop working over time? Who knows? Well, let's stay on that word blood flow. No blood flow to the heart, what do you get? You get a heart attack, okay? If you're in America, you get a very expensive bill that comes along with that and a bunch of medications, perhaps a stent as well, you know what I mean, depending on the severity of it. No blood flow to the heart, you get a heart attack. No blood flow to the brain, stroke. This is, this is crazy stuff, this is deep, okay? Listen to me now. No blood flow to your Johnson, what do you get? Erectile dysfunction 
and the girl in your bed putting, or man, putting her pants back on and leaving. No blood flow there means no, no worky. That's what we're getting at. No blood flow means no worky. And by no means my hair loss hair expert, I'm just your average dude who makes videos on the internet and just sort of documents things that I'm enjoying in my life. And most of those things tend to do with health, wellness, healthy lifestyle, but also balancing out fun. Like I blacked out on Tuesday. I don't remember seven hours of that entire day. I was so drunk. You know what I mean? Balance, guys. So how can we increase blood, more blood flow to the scalp? Because, you know, why do you get a massage? You get a massage because it increases blood flow. You move it around, increases blood flow to that area. So you get more nutrients, more oxygen to those muscles. It relieves tension. It relieves stress, right? So that needs to be done to the scalp. I'm talking about bringing blood flow to the scalp manually via massage or other methods. So I've found three things and I can yap. I can yap all day long, guys. You gotta stick with me here. I promise you it's gonna be good stuff. I've come down to three items that I'm gonna have in my daily and regular routine. One is like the like the kind of like the bare minimum, very cheap, few dollars. It takes just a few dollars, but it takes manual work to do every day. And there's a uh, option number two. This is the medium one. This is like, this can definitely bring some results. You don't have to do it every day. It might hurt a little bit, but that's fine. But it's a good option. Then the third option, I'm not even gonna call these options because it's best if you just do them all together, which is what I'm gonna be doing. The third thing is a product called the Grow Band Pro. So if we can increase blood flow on a regular basis to the scalp, a place that does not, you wouldn't think blood would just flow there I mean, it would flow, blood flows all over our body, but how can we increase that? How can we get more going there without having to use minoxidil or without having to result to finasteride, things that, you know, block DHD and, and, and manipulate your hormones in a certain way and just, just, you know, good God, I swear to you, this coffee is fantastic. Like I said, whey protein, collagen protein, all different kinds, you know, there's collagen type one, two, three, four, and fucking five, it's insane. It's got all that in there. Lion's Mane, which is great for your brain. I've made videos in the past on another channel, an old channel, an old lover, let's say, on Lion's Mane mushroom and different mushroom extracts. And they're 100% worth considering of putting into your routine. But that might be a separate video for another time. If you have questions, drop them in a comment down below. So the first thing that I want to talk about here, very simple. I got this on Amazon. I paid $6.99, very simple, very easy product to use. It's simply these silicone brushes here. And if you have dandruff, and, or, or maybe you don't even know you do, if you start using this, you will realize, holy shit, I have some dead skin on my scalp, which is normal. So basically you just, it's as easy as it fucking looks. We're gonna spend the least time on this thing because you just go like this. And honestly, dude, it feels so good. I'll be sitting here watching a movie, chilling, watching, you know, some YouTube, whatever, and I'm massaging my scalp and it feels amazing. Obviously bringing blood flow to the area and getting things moving up there. Perhaps, perhaps breaking up adhesions. It's just nice. Only thing is your fucking shoulder is going to start kicking. Hold on. Let me do it with my other hand so I can show off my new tattoo right there. Can you see it? Um, you know, your hands start to just, it gets a little tiring after a couple minutes. You're just kind of like, all right, whatever. It just fucking feels good. It's nice. Only downside is you got to do it. It's manual. Obviously you got to do it and it gets tiring <clears throat> after a while. Okay. Next. Jesus Christ. <clears throat> okay. Next, by the way, this is the longest I've had my hair in a very long time. The second thing, let me go get it. Now this I have yet to try, but I got comments in some of my other hair videos telling me to do this. And, and I'm sorry for overlooking your comments. Usually I take my audience's comments very seriously. I, I, I do, I read every single one because I'm looking in my app every single day. This is a micro needler or a derma roller. The thought with this is you do it once or twice a week, about six to eight times in a horizontal manner and then six to eight times in a vertical manner in whatever area you want to apply this. A lot of ladies use this on their face. A lot of men use this on the beard or on their scalp or on whatever, you know what I mean, to grow more hair. And this is interesting to me. I have yet to try it, but I'm just going to let you know that I am going to be using this. So you just kind of go on your scalp and I kind of got to, ooh, yeah, you can feel it. What I got to do is I got to get a comb. Oh, my hair's getting stuck in the roller. You got to get a comb and sort of part my hair uh, and then 
roll and then part my hair, you know, a few inches over and then roll and so that I'm actually needling my scalp. Does that make sense? You can really feel it, feel it in here in my arm. And so what this does is a couple of things that are very, very interesting. Yes, I just Googled it because uh, I remembered, but I, then I forgot, okay? So a derma roller or a micro needler specifically for hair growth works by creating tiny injuries. So basically these tiny little pokes in your fucking scalp that stimulate the skin's natural healing process that therefore promotes hair growth. It can promote collagen production, blood circulation, different growth factors, cell regeneration, healthy hair regrowth, and uh, actually drug delivery as well, which is really interesting because I do do some fucking research and came across a study, I'll put it a link in the description, basically showing a, a group of different people, one using minoxidil, one using minoxidil with a derma roller. And minoxidil with a derma roller group saw significantly better results in hair growth than just the minoxidil group. So this can help basically help minoxidil get a little bit deeper in there, I guess. You know, that's, I'm super paraphrasing for the layman here, but that's basically what is happening. Ooh, you can feel it, man. So I'm gonna be doing this. Only thing is, is that, you know, it can take some time to just sit there and part your hair, you know, so that that way you really get to the scalp, especially if you have a lot of hair like myself right at the moment. Definitely gonna be trying that. Now, the third thing that I think is really interesting, and this I have been using for about a week, two weeks now, uh, maybe in between, maybe 10 days, and I haven't been doing it every day because I have yet to start doing these things on a daily basis. This is the video of me letting you know what I'm doing going forward and I will have an update video in six months time, okay? I promise you. This is called the Grow Band and this is their version two. Now, full disclaimer for everyone watching this, I've been in the YouTube game for a while now. This product was sent to me for free. However, the dudes, at least Sean, who I've been in communication with, they all seem freaking awesome. I was supposed to put this video out weeks ago and they were totally okay with me taking my time. I just had some things happen, life is busy. They do not have any creative control over the video. They do not get any say in what I say about this in this video. So this is a genuine, transparent review and sort of firsthand experience with this product that I'm giving you, but they are not paying me to say anything or they're not they're not paying me anything. They sent this to me for free to try it out because obviously my Minoxidil video has popped off and this fits right in line with what I want and what I believe you want as well. So look at this fucking thing. What you do, you set it about an inch or so above your eyebrow and then you want sort of the side parts to be just right above the ear. There's a little, turny knob in the back to help you tighten it. And so what this is going to do, once I turn it on, then there's a tube and it goes up to here, okay? Once I turn it on, it's essentially going to put pressure on my scalp, sort of in this upward motion. You will literally see my head move. And what this is doing is massaging your head. It's, it's a scalp massager, but it's an automatic one. Not only is it bringing blood flow to your scalp, vasodilation, all these different things that we want to happen on the scalp, it also just feels amazing. This is why I love the product. To me, it feels like a head massage. I love massages. I go to a chiropractor on a weekly basis. I get massages on a bi-monthly basis, bi-weekly basis, sorry, twice a month. And when I'm sitting here watching a show, I literally pop this thing on with the flip of a switch. I hit play and you can see. You can see it physically moving my, all the skin and my fat head up and down, up and down. There is a good amount of science and studies done on blood flow to the scalp and scalp massages for men, women, for not just hair regrowth, but also stress, blood pressure, heart rate. It's actually really interesting. I think what the real, my personal opinion, what the real long-term effective, safe, and natural answer to hair loss is, is derma rolling and scalp massages in combination perhaps with minoxidil. That is what my theory is and that's what I'm gonna be testing. I'm still, still gonna be applying my minoxidil once a day. I'm gonna be doing derma rolling one to two times per week and then using the Grow Band Pro 
on a daily basis, which is the easiest freaking thing. I literally sit here, I'm watching, I'm, do I'm doing it while I'm making a YouTube video. I mean, come on, like I can, you can do it while you work at the computer, watching TV, whatever. And like I said, they're not paying me to say any of these things. It just feels fucking good, man. It feels like a really nice massage and you don't have to manually do anything yourself or have someone else do it. Honestly, I think it's a fantastic product. If you are interested in trying one for yourself, you can use the code vlogish, that's the name of my channel, on their website, that will get you $100 off and your price for one of these will be $397. Usually it's a $500 product. You can get it for $397 if you want. But I think this is the future. This is what hair regrowth, stalling hair loss, and possibly reversing hair loss is all about. Derma rolling and scalp massaging, and this is the way to go with it. So I definitely appreciate uh, the guys over at, uh, at Hair Guard and Grow Band Pro for saying that over for me because it was weird. It's, it's this thing I call divine timing. Like things, I, I'm not trying to get all woo woo or whatever here, but I genuinely, genuinely believe that things, all things happen for a reason, good or bad. And uh, I started to notice like, fuck my hair again. You know what I mean? Minoxidil, come on, bro, you're not working. And then I get an email for these guys and it was just absolutely amazing. And that introduced me to derma rolling as well as uh, using this. So for the next six months, that's gonna be my daily and regular routine. And I want you guys to follow along on this journey with me. So in the next six, seven, six to eight months, I'll have an update video on how we're looking up here, okay? And I just wanna say one last and final thing. This channel is not a hair care channel. It's not a men's hair care channel, okay? Sorry to lay back there like that. This is a channel where I talk about things that I'm currently experimenting with or am interested in or whatever. Most of those things do revolve around living a healthy lifestyle in general, not just hair. Subscribe if you like the vibe. Check out the link below to get yourself a Grow Band Pro, and I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.